Hey guys, um, so today I'm going to be working on this motherboard. It's got a few bent pins. Um, I already started poking at them a little bit, uh, and uh, I think I can get them back into the spot they're supposed to be. Um, anyways, this is the Beastie. You can kind of see right there. See that group there that's looks a little bit different than the rest of them. That's where the pins were bent. Um, <coughs> anyways, I'm going to try to bend those back into the right general location. See if I can get this puppy up and going, and then I'm going to pop a processor in and try to boot it. My weapon of choice here is a sewing needle. <coughs> And basically we're just going to try to poke and prod them back into the right place so that these rows line up. Once I get them kind of visually all in line, it's probably going to be close enough. I've had a lot of people um, over the years, you know, uh, if something's... You've got a bent pin, they're like, oh, that's pretty much it, man. I've actually had several machines that were uh, bent. The processor came with bent pins or something like that. And I've every time I've been able to bend everything back to where it's supposed to be, boot and... Get years of service out of them without a without an issue. So we're gonna see if we can do that here today. See if I can get something a little stiffer here. Okay. They still look a little bit funny, but they've got the tips all where they're supposed to be. actual points the ends are right about in the right spot in the rows now we can strip the components out of the post machine here Yeah. Now we can swap the two. Begin by turning these guys. Um, at this point, we're going to need to clean up the paste off of the um, old ones. I'm going to go and grab myself something to do that with. Okay, I'm just going to do this quick and dirty in case this doesn't end up panning out anywho. Okay, 
So now we've got our basic board set up here. We are going to pop this puppy back in the case. Okay. Our case is ready here. the RAM. So these are kind of interesting uh, RAM slots and they have a clip on one side. So you basically start the RAM in on one side and then slot it into the other here. So I'm going to hook up my monitor here so I can get some video. I will hook up my keyboard and mouse. And then give it some power. That's on. Looking good. And it looks like it sees the processor. New CPU installed. Let's see. It's pressing F1. Yeah, I think we're golden. Um, so today you saw how to bend the chips back in place or the pins back in place if you've got a bum motherboard. Um, I wouldn't necessarily recommend this uh, as a first resort, but if you end up with something that you can work with, then by all means, this is a, a good way to go. Uh, thanks for watching my video and you have a nice day.